Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. Today's video, I just wanted to sit down and basically do a life update video. I haven't done one of these before, but I thought I kind of needed to do one because a few things have been happening and I just kind of wanted to clear some things up and let you know a few things. Please ignore my hair, like I've got baby hair everywhere going all sorts of directions and it just won't sit nice. Oh and that's another thing, yes I dyed my hair back to purple, it has faded a little bit but I'm getting it done very soon but yes I'm back to the purple, I feel so much more like myself and I need to stop touching my hair now. <laughs> So I want to talk about a few things in this video, like I said, but I don't want this to be like a really, really long video. I kind of want it to be short and straight to the point kind of thing, if I can do that because it's me we're talking about, I'm Miss Chatterbox. I don't know if any of you have noticed, but in the past, oh my god, I don't even know how long it's been, maybe eight months or so, since last August, start of September, I haven't been filming as much videos, as many videos, sorry, than I used to. I was actually on quite a roll with my vlogs and my videos and I was so happy with how my YouTube was going and I was uploading more. I was like talking to more people on this network and just, yeah, I was so, so happy with how my channel was going pretty much. And yeah, recently I just haven't been filming, well, not recently, but in that eight, nine months, however long it's been since August, start of September, um, I haven't been uploading as frequently as I used to and that's pretty much because something really, really drastic happened in my life that I never would have thought would have happened. And the reason why I'm mentioning it in this video is because, whew, I did not think I was going to get upset, that's for sure. It's because I was gaining a lot of subscribers at that time. Yeah, I have 13,000, that's a lot. Like, for me, that's a lot. To some people, it's not. But to have that many people on a channel, I feel like kind of that I owe it to you guys for an explanation as to why I wasn't uploading as many videos as I was. But yeah, like I said, a drastic change happened in my life. And I'm pretty much my granny who has actually been on my YouTube channel. I think she's been in two of my videos. I had a vlog that I made like when I first started vlogging. That was when I was like 17, she was in that. And then the last vlog she was in was when it was my birthday in July. So this happened August, September after that July month. And pretty much we found out that my gran had terminal cancer. And I'll always remember the day that it happened and from that day it went so, so fast. My gran and grandpa lived in Perth. As some of you may know, I used to tweet like, oh, going to Perth to visit my gran and grandpa and I used to vlog up there and stuff like that. Yeah, so they had to move into my house so we could look after my gran. She needed to eventually, uh, 24 hour care. Yeah, they moved in here, which meant that my sister had to then share a room with me. My room isn't exactly the biggest room ever. It is quite big, but for two people, it makes it seem very, very small, which is why I started to film with a backdrop because I did not want to show people what my room looked like. Well, looks like because it still is a shit tip. Excuse my language. So yeah, me and my sister have been sharing a room for, um, months and months now and it was so hard to film videos whilst someone else was in the room and do like makeup tutorials and during that time I wasn't really in the mood to film videos to say the least because my gran pretty much was dying down the stairs. I wasn't really in the mood to film like makeup tutorials and to pretend to be all happy because it wasn't a happy time. I just wanted to kind of say that to be like that's why I wasn't filming videos and also why I haven't recently been filming videos because I still am sharing a room with my sister and it is very difficult to film videos like I said with someone else in the room like I can't just like all the time get out my filming equipment and like block out half the room while someone else is there. It might not make sense, but it's just not always as easy to do that. And also, some of you may know the situation that happened with my gran because obviously you might know me personally and um, you may see me put up, like I'm not really one to post personal stuff, although I kind of am, but that kind of personal, I don't really post, but on the day of my grand's funeral in January, I did post something on like Instagram, I think it might have been, so you may know from that. Yeah, I'm gonna stop talking about that now because still to this day, it hasn't hit me that it's happened and that's why sometimes when I start talking about it, I'm like, oh, get really emotional and 
I don't really want to cry on camera or talk about it because it's still, yeah, like I said, I still can't believe that it happened. I literally thought my gran and grandpa were indestructible, like you do, and it just, yeah, it, I don't think it'll ever hit me, to be honest, but yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know the situation because yeah i just feel like i was slacking on my youtube channel because i just wasn't in the mood to film videos if i'm not in the mood to film a video i am not going to film a video because it probably won't turn out great <laughs> if you film videos yourself you'll know that so starting off the video kind of with a negative moving on to a positive by the time this video goes up, I reckon it will only be about four or something days until this happens and I can't believe I'm saying this because this doesn't even feel real yet but my boyfriend and I, Declan, we've decided to move to Canada. We booked the flights like five weeks ago or four weeks ago actually because when we booked them we had five weeks to go so we've known this for four weeks that we were definitely going because the flights were booked and still saying that out loud like I'm moving to Canada doesn't feel real like and I don't think it will feel real until I'm there even on the plane I'll probably think be thinking that I'm going to like Spain or something like that it doesn't feel real but yeah I am so excited I am a little bit stressed at the same time but I am so excited for like this adventure. If you know me, you know I love traveling, hence my traveling tattoo I have on my wrist which looks a bit lopsided when I show it on camera. I am so so excited and I'm also so excited to do this with him. I just think it's going to be amazing. So that's the other thing that I wanted to talk to you all about in this video is the fact that I'm moving to Canada which isn't exactly down the road it's like across the pond yeah I'm nervous I won't know anyone there apart from Declan obviously I won't have any friends I don't have a job as of yet and yeah so if you're in Canada and want to be my friend hit me up because I will be Jamie no mates for a while but yeah I've said to myself I've set myself a goal that moving to Canada is going to be the start of me pushing myself with my YouTube again because it's a hobby of mine that I want to keep up. Anyone else who's got a hobby, they want to keep it up and love it and keep on doing it. This is how I feel about doing YouTube videos. It genuinely makes me happy putting up a video and editing a video. Even if not that many people watch it, it still makes me happy and making vlogs and stuff, they're like memories to look back on so that's why I love making vlogs which is also Another point to say is when I'm moving to Canada, I'm going to be doing daily vlogs. Not like, well, hmm, shall I say daily vlogs? I'm not going to be doing a video, like a video every single day, but maybe like two a week or something because I kind of want these videos to look back on, like I said, but also so my like family and friends and so like Declan's family can look at these videos and be nosy, I guess, or just like see how we're getting on, even though of course we're going to like FaceTime them and stuff like that. But that is why I want to do some daily vlogs too. And I just think it'll be fun. I absolutely love vlogging. I'm getting into it more. And why not? Moving to Canada is a big thing. Why shouldn't I vlog it? Today is, what day is it? It's Tuesday the 28th, isn't it? Because I think this is actually when I get paid. So I should know this date. Um, and I'm going next Thursday. So I don't know when this video is going to go up. But I'm basically going in a week and two days and by the time this goes up, like I said, it'll probably be like four days till I go and I'm going to vlog going over there and, you know, staying in our little hotel, getting our little apartment or house or whatever we get because we have no idea. And yeah, I'm just going to vlog that all. So I have these videos as memories pretty much. And whilst I'm there, obviously, I'm going to take my backgrounds or I might have a nice background there, like... A little dressing table or something I don't know what's gonna happen yet but I'm still going to be doing my makeup tutorials and I've actually wrote a list of videos to do like even videos like my fake tan routine how I maintain my purple hair how I do my eyebrows and little videos like that I've literally made a list on my phone and I'm just gonna crack on with doing my YouTube videos because when I do my YouTube videos literally it makes me so happy like I said it's a hobby and hobbies make people happy YouTube makes me happy. I said this video wasn't going to be really long and I bet it probably is but I just wanted to touch on those two things in this video basically explaining why I wasn't doing videos like I used to for those eight or so months and my big life change that's happening next week which is scary. I also just want to apologize if this has been kind of 
a skew with video if you want to call it that I feel like I kind of went blah and didn't really make much sense but hopefully it was all right <laughs> so guys Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you'll stick around for these upcoming videos, including these vlogs, because I think they will be pretty fun, if I do say so myself. And yeah, just thanks for sticking by me. Like I said, I've got 13,000 subscribers. That is a lot of people. Yes, to some people it's not, but for me, 13,000 is a lot of people. So yeah, thank you so much for sticking around. Thank you for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. And please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already as that would mean the world to me. I will see you in my next video which will either be a makeup tutorial or I'm going to Craig David with Ellis on Tuesday night. So I'm going to be vlogging that. No, that's Monday night. Mm. So I'm going to be vlogging that. So you'll either see a makeup tutorial or a vlog next. So I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.